Hi, my name is Engineer Shahzad Khan. In today's video, I will discuss the quantity estimation of frame structure building. A wall is to be built between two columns. The quantity of excavation for two columns in wall, concrete 1 ratio 7 ratio 20 under the brickwork of wall, RCC 1 ratio 2 ratio 4 and 2 column up to the plinth level, brickwork up to the plinth level in wall, DPC 1 ratio 2 ratio 4, 4 cm thick on the wall plinth level. Here is the top view of the wall between two columns. RCC 1 ratio 2 ratio 4 and first step. RCC 1 ratio 2 ratio 4 and second step. RCC column 30 cross 20 cm. Concrete 1 ratio 7 ratio 20 under the wall foundation. Brick work in wall foundation in first step. Brick work in wall foundation in second step. For better understanding, the 3D visualization of the given section is shown. To find the excavation of two columns, consider the top view of the column, multiply the length with width and the depth of excavation is from the ground level to the base of the footing. The quantity of excavation become 0.576 cubic meter. For two columns, multiply it with two. So the total quantity of excavation for two wall become 1.152 cubic meter. Similarly, to find out the wall excavation, first to find out the wall excavation length, the spacing between the two columns is 10 meter. So detect point 3 offset from each column to get excavation length, that is 9.4 meter. For the wall excavation, multiply length of the wall with width of the wall and depth from the ground level to the base of the wall foundation. For concrete 1 ratio 7 ratio 20 under the brickwork of wall foundation, multiply the wall concrete length with width and thickness of concrete. So the total concrete become 0.5 cubic meter. For the RCC in first tip of the column, multiply the first tip length with width and thickness. Multiply the RCC in the first step by 2 for the two column. Similarly, for the second step, multiply the second step length and width and thickness. For the third step, multiply the column length with width and count the height up to the ground level. For brickwork in wall in first step, multiply first step brickwork length with width and height. And similarly, for second step brickwork, multiply brickwork length with width and count height up to the plinth level. The same method can be used to find out these quantities above from the plinth level. For DPC, we need to find out wall area at plinth level. Multiply the length with width to get the DPC quantity. These quantities are also calculated in Excel sheet. To learn the procedure, how to find out these quantities in Excel, watch the video link in the description below. Please like and subscribe the channel for upcoming video updates.